to our classmates and to our dearest instructor, Ma'am Melody Mira Idul, a pleasant day to everyone. I am Rachel Jane Igagamo Magallanes from BS Ed English 2B. And for today's video, I am going to elaborate my insights and ideas I got from the given article focusing on what you really know when you know a language or shall I say what I really know when I know a language. So let's start first from the very basic question, what is language? You know, we use language in our daily lives. In our day-to-day -day interactions, language serves as many purposes. Language is innate in us, human beings, that distinguishes us from any living creatures, such as with animals. Through language, we establish intimate connections with others. It gives access to a wider world, and this has become our means of learning. Language is very important, and it considers as a human life because we exist with language. Thanks to language, we are able to share our opinions, thoughts, ideas, and everything we say. But in this video, I would just want to go back to the topic and answer the specific question. What do you know when you know a language? First of all, you have linguistic knowledge. When you know a language, you know what is the significance of it. There is a vast amount of a specific knowledge, including what the word means, arrangement of words in a sentence, and how we utter those words for us to be understood. Second is that you have knowledge of sound system. For example, you know which sounds that belongs to your native language and which do not. These generally determine from our internal linguistic systems. Third, you have knowledge of words. You have a lot of vocabularies in your minds and you know their meanings. Number four, you know how to identify words and fluent speech or speech segmentation. Next, you know how to properly pronounce words or the phonology. Say, for example, the word kitty and kitty. So, because of our phonological knowledge, we know that the execution of the first word is the proper one, which is kitty. Sixth one, you know that certain words behave like other words. These are the phrases, words that we put together similarly. Also, you know how to interpret words in context. You know how to put words together to ask questions. And you know how to identify the right interpretation in context. Through knowing a language, we know how to properly use the phonetics, phonology, morphology, syntax, pragmatics, and other things. There's still more, but just giving you the sort of things when you know a language. Language is broad and it needs to be mastered effectively put into use. So that's it. Thank you for listening and I hope that even in a short span of time, I was able to share my ideas to you. Keep safe always and God bless us all.